Hi, my name is Patrick Mellick. I'm an associate engineer at Amitech PMC Dynamic Fluid Solutions Regenerative Blower Group. Welcome to another installment of our how-to series. Today we'll be talking about our nameplate. Where is it, what's on it, and how to effectively communicate what blower model you have should you need to speak with someone at Amitech or to one of our field representatives about your blower. Each blower we ship from our factory here in Sorgates, New York has an identifying label called a nameplate located somewhere on the blower. Sometimes it's on the muffler, but usually you can find it on the motor as you see here. The first item you want to be aware of is the blower part number. This number will allow the factory to understand what blower model you have and exactly what goes into building it. The second number you want to take note of is the date code. This is a three section number with two digits in the first section, one to two digits in the second section, and one to three digits in the third section. It's in the format year, week, day. The nomenclature, which is at the top of the label, is a quick reference to the features of a blower. A breakdown of the nomenclature can be found in our latest catalog in section I, pages 11 and 12, or ask your field representative for tool PT9. On rare occasions, the Amitech colleague may ask you for a work order number. This is an eight-digit number starting with BB or BP. We can use this number to discover specific details about the build of this blower. If this number starts with EO or ES, it means you have a custom blower, and it's important that you give this information to the Amitech colleague in order to help them to help you. The other electrical information on the nameplate is used in conjunction with the electrical data on the motor by a licensed electrician in order to properly wire the blower. This wraps up our look at the Regenerative Blower nameplate. Thank you for watching. We hope you found this video helpful. We hope you watch the other videos in this how-to series. Goodbye.